Hi, super freelancers and business owners. Happy New Year. This is Margaret, the creator of Article and Design. The pandemic was one of the primary reasons we built the Article and Design community last year. It was an answer to a call for Filipinos to earn from the safety of their homes. Last year, 2020, I co-founded the Article and Design community, formerly known as Super Financers PH, with a friend shortly after launching the Super Financers podcast, now called Article and Design Podcast. We want to help Filipinas create a premium career in freelancing and transform freelancers into what we call hashtag super freelancers, a highly paid, creative, happy, and globally competitive freelancer. With Article and Design's hashtag 1 million mission, we believe that when we all work together, we can transform 1 million Filipino freelancers into super freelancers. But as we are aware, the pandemic didn't go away. Instead, it has become the new normal. But time and again, people adapt especially Filipinas. We are innovative and we move forward. Virtually, everything turned into online gatherings, just like what we're doing right now. The good side of this, if we didn't create this community, you and I will never be here at the same screen. You and I will never e-meet each other. You and I will never find comfort in each other's experiences. You and I will never share waves of laughter, memes, and struggles in freelancing and business, and even our personal lives. And most of all, you and I will never know that we all have the same mission. We all have the same heart. For us at Article on Design, our work has never been more relevant today. So it is a pleasure and a privilege to share the things I learned as a practitioner for over nine years and showcase the talent of every Filipino creative individual. Overall, it was a challenging year, especially for me as your founder and as you look up to me as your leader, or nanay, if you will. We made mistakes, fixed them, and learn from this process. Personally, I have to admit, there are many, many times that I want to give up this community and this mission. But I always ask myself, why would I? Why would I give up? What's the point of being human beings if we don't look after each other? What's the point of being a Filipino or simply a citizen of this world if we don't extend a helping hand? I saw my fellow Filipinas penny pinching on projects and charging $1 gigs just to get hired while I was booking premium clients. So it doesn't sit well with me. I was reading my fellow freelancers' experiences that they have been discriminated in the workplace simply because they are Filipinas or they came from a developing country. I feel something needs to be done here. I want to be part of the solution and not the problem. I want to be on the right side of history. So thank you to everyone who is helping me in this mission and wants to be part of the solution. And most of all, thank you for the trust you gave me. I am nowhere near perfect, but I always strive to be my best to put Filipino talents on the map. Please continue giving your feedback and testimonials to us. It makes article and design better. And I can assure you, I read and watch every one of those personally. But we're not yet finished. We are barely scratching the surface. So much more needs to be created to make this mission reach every Filipino at every corner of this world. Sometimes, as creatives, we tend to undermine our achievements over the success of others. I do this too. I am too hard on myself. I have imposter syndrome. But every time I see one Filipino, a freelancer, or a business owner trying to earn their keep, 
posting their small wins on Facebook and promoting their businesses and online shops. It reminds me that the mission is alive. And that's why the mission is here. And it will outlive you and me. If you've been following me, you know I always say this. Don't focus on how far you're going. Focus on how far you've come. And that's what we're doing right now. We're far from reaching 1 million, but a million thanks to everyone who's been with us since day one. We wouldn't be here without you. Thank you for helping us along the way. And I will need your support as I continue to navigate this movement we are partaking in. Call it a rebellion, guys, and I am here for it. Thank you for being with us in 2021 and for the many years to come. Together, we can make the global freelancing place a lot better for every Filipino. Happy Holidays and Happy New Year to all the super freelancers and business owners. On behalf of the article and design family, here's to a successful 2022. I wish you all the best and stay grounded, my friends. With all my heart, Margaret Lapas. Good evening, everyone. Merry Christmas and happy holidays. Hello to our freelancers, business owners, guests, and friends. Uh, welcome to our article and design virtual Christmas party. <laughs> Just a quick introduction. Um, would you like to start, Margaret, or I'll start? So, hello, everyone. I'm Jules Rivera. I am a community manager for the article and design Facebook group called Super Philosophy's page. I also write for the article and design. So it's it's been a bit, it's been a good progress for us because yeah, guys, technically we restarted everything in January, February. So I'm super proud of the team, article and design. Of course, the Jules and Rodara. I am one part and more Chris Nett is article and design. Of course, my uh, back end team. So of course, we're super proud because we're doing article and design on the sidelines. Because guys, we want to work. We are free netters. Remember, we are practitioners. So we're doing article on the side, the sidelines, but we can just imagine the progress that we did, diba? So how much more, guys? If mas marami pa uh, na magtulong tulong. Bye.
Baka alam mo rin ko kaya na naging independent yung Philippines sa US. July 4, 1946. Wow! Ang galing! Ang galing! Here's to a successful 2022 and I wish you all the best and stay grounded, my friends. Cheers! Happy New Year! Oh, <laughs>